Today's episode is the first in a series from Moab, Utah, including two national parks. Today I have Utah 128 Scenic Byway out of Moab. Hi, I'm Don with Cowboy Biker Adventures, the Imperfect RV Travel and Adventure Channel. I think you're going to enjoy today's scenery. Thank you for coming along on this scenic view or ride of Utah 128 from 191, US 191. I was told that you, I would love this drive or ride from Mark Guido on Grand Adventures on YouTube. Or, excuse me, Grand Adventure, no S, on YouTube. Look at this, will you? They even have a bike trail, hiking trail, or jogging trail, whatever you want to call it down there. Look at this. Riverway regulations. Colorado Riverway Recreation Area. This Colorado River this follows. Beautiful, beautiful faces. Not the beautiful colors that I saw in Capitol Reef. Those were amazing. In my opinion, those were even better than Zion. Look at this, will you? Oh, there's that bike, bicycle trail. could be dangerous. Is that an islet in the stream? I don't know. I have to ask Dolly Parton, I guess. Kenny Rogers can't ask him anymore. Oh, look at that. Oh, I'm gonna love reviewing this video. Hey, something was in the water. Didn't get a good look. Oh, more than one kayaks, I'm sure. Oh, got a bike trail again. Grand staff, grand staff trailhead. Oh, look at this, will you? This don't take your breath away. Even all the beautiful places I've seen lately, this is still wow. That's a campground, that's the second one I've seen.
Oh, bikes are back on the road. Oh, they had a fire some time ago. Oh, look at that. This is more beautiful than Million Dollar Highway. You don't have to be on the edge for a thousand feet or whatever. I like it. videos on both of those so check out my playlist Colorado playlist will get you there Put up a 
Hey, they got some Class A in here, this one. Well, these people don't mess around. You know, I thought the speed limit was 45, and I'm going over that. I don't know what they're in a hurry for. Don't they want to take in the scenery? I'm in the rocks. There's another little campground. Or is this the same one? I don't know. They're all over through here. I walked down now. Seven or eight. At least. That is cool. Fifty and fifty five's not fast enough for these people. Wow. My only one that tries to obey the speed limit laws, I guess. Of course now that I'm retired and more relaxed and not you know, usually on a time crunch so much. Just self imposed if I do have them. Uh, I learned to slow down, and I enjoy life so much better. That, and stop watching the news, and stay off of Facebook other than post my videos and Instagram posts. So much happier. All, they, all that stuff does is keep you wound up and scared. And, uh... I think you're supposed to be smart, but not scared. Let's just say the adventure uh, industry. Just like my adventures, I bring you on free. Except for the, does cost you the one most valuable thing you own. And that's your time. This ought to be one heck of a view right here. like the water's moving. Turn off should 
be within the next three miles. And these people just can't, some of these people just gotta drive fast. I don't get it. I do not get it. It'd be fun to go through here 70 miles an hour, but I ain't doing it. Pull off, people pull out in front of you. Don't know where to make around next bend. I'm going a little bit above the speed limit, and I got a car on my butt, and he's still thinking about passing on the double yellow line. Sandy Beach.
Paso Valley. Thank you for coming along on this scenic ride with me today. Remember, stick around after the credits for a bonus video where I show scenes from next week's episode and adventure. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. If you would like to see adventure videos once a week, folks, it's about the scenery. Please subscribe and ring the bell so you will get notifications when I bring out the next video. So don't go anywhere, so we're not done yet. Alright, here we go, down to the Sal Loop Road. Thank you for sticking around for bonus video this week. I will show scenes from next week's episode from LaSalle Mountain Loop. Actually, I did a short on this, so I'm just going to show you the short. I go over this mountain somehow. This is one of three mountains I had to climb and pass over on this sound loop ride of about 47 miles, if I remember correctly. Thank you for joining me for this week's episode. I hope you come back next week for another adventure from Mohab LaSalle Mountain Loop Ride. I promise you it's beautiful. Until next time, have a good one.